the Tour de France is one of the greatest sporting occasions in the world, and last year, South Africa made its presence felt with the success of Team Kubeka. Voted the most popular team in the peloton in what was their maiden tour, they are looking for an even better year in 2016. Now known as Dimension Data Kubeka, the team gathered for a training camp in Cape Town and were hosted by Southern Sun the Cullinan during their time in the mother city. So the city of Cape Town actually came to us and they said, you know, we use cycling to advertise Cape Town to the world as a beautiful, safe cycling destination. So we said, well, why not have our, our training camp in Cape Town? Douglas and I met at a sports dinner one evening. And then uh, probably two months after that, he called me and said, look, great opportunity. We're launching this team in Cape Town. You guys want to get involved. You know, Soho Sun has been such a supporter of cycling over the years. You know, they sponsor cycling events like the Soho Sun Amashova. And, you know, it was the first people that we went to go and speak to to say we'd love to come and so they really accommodated us and, and the staff here have been fantastic. Now we basically sponsored the accommodation for the team and in doing so all of the high profile events around the launch were held at the Cullinan. I just think the, the opportunity for Tsoho and for the Cullinan in particular is just fantastic you know with, with the likes of Mark Cavendish standing in that hotel for the full week. Uh, it's just such an opportunity to have the cycling world watching Cape Town. It's a beautiful place to ride your bike, beautiful weather, friendly people and cycling massively and now the amount of people that ride bikes, it's, it's pretty spectacular, you know. The training camp was an opportunity for new members of the team to get to know one another, talk about their goals for 2016 and of course sample the beauty of Cape Town. The most important thing is connecting the riders together in an environment where, you know, they can drink some wine together, they can enjoy the scenery, and there's no pressure on performance. And to do it with Tsoko Sun as a partner, you know, what more could you want? They, they had a phenomenal time. They loved the city. They loved the hotel. They really did. In fact, Mark Cavendish came back and uh, had a family holiday at the hotel. People are friendly, it's great food, great wine to have in the off season as well. So uh, you can have a little bit of holiday as well as not going down to ride your bike. To have the guys like Mark Cavendish, Mark Renshaw, some of the best sprinters in the world, to even want to join our team shows how this team has grown and shows how you know, how successful it's been and, and what an aspirational team it has become in cycling. Team Kubeka is more than just a cycling team, they're also a charity. They help people move forward by giving bicycles and return for work done to improve communities. The whole aspect of the Kubeka Foundation and what the team stands for is huge and I think that generates a lot of goodwill. The team is like much bigger than just a team that goes out and do races. We have a much bigger cause and that is to mobilize kids in Africa. So it's really special to know that we can actually help improve other people's lives. That being said, also from a purely sporting aspect, we have a great roster. Um, we have a good balance of experienced riders and really young talent. I think we're going to win a lot of races with Mark, but we also have some really good young African guys who are on their way to greatness. If I can mentor, if we can help the African riders and bring more African riders into the professional peloton, then that will be the biggest bonus. With the success of the training camp, let's hope that the first African team to ride the Tour de France can one day provide the first African winner. As the team strives to make that dream a reality in the near future, here's hoping it happens sooner rather than later.